Hey, Transformers Earth Wars, this is Sick and Twisted bringing you another episode of Transformers Earth Wars. This is a friend of mine's account. Uh, he entrusted me with his username and password, and I knew he was currently at work at the time, so I knew I could get away with getting onto his account without telling him. <laughs> kind of a little funny here. I showed up to his base and I was going to do a little bit of a preview and I was going to, um, I noticed on another account of mine that uh, there was a Build-A-Bot bundle for $10 and I was going to just give him a surprise and give him that uh, fifth builder that he is uh, really in need of, especially being lower accounts, the the more build about you have, the quicker you can advance. But unfortunately, when I got onto this account, it wasn't available here. I'm not sure why. Um, it had other different bundles available, but on uh, my other two accounts, it both showed it. So I was unable to surprise him with that fifth build -bot. but when I got onto this account I noticed that all of his workers were currently not working and he did not have any bots upgrading. So I did a whole bunch of battles and I did manage to get all of his workers going plus one of his bots upgrading which will be very very important for um, uh, the wars and the upcoming weekends event so just wanted to keep him going and being able to uh, advance as best as he can while he's at work. Um, I got his swindle going up. I probably should have done Rampage first, but uh, his Megatron's really strong. His Megatron's already upgraded. Uh, I know Rampage is a three-star compared to the Megatron that's a uh, two-star, but Megatron's uh, special ability is inspiring charge which is a great advantage especially to poorly built bases so i decided to give him a little bit more firepower as far as doing a gunner um, hopefully he will see this video and think about doing rampage next now i also noticed that when i came on here i probably could have done a video of upgrading his base because uh his base was a train wreck oh my gosh um not sure why he changed his base the way he did but he was asking for an ass whooping each and every time so i decided to change his base and this is the base that i came up with um it's a pretty effective base i've used it many times before um, when i was lower and it was very very effective basically i put his defenses up here in front and then his uh, headquarters in the middle, and I did use his laser turret for behind. Make it a little bit harder, especially if somebody comes in with uh, not as far of ranged uh, bots, that his laser may be able to do some major damage. I also put his um, stasis mines up front, so that way they can be stunned on the way in. Um, it works really good. I've got the double walls on both on the far outsides, make it a little harder for them to try and sneak around. Plus putting all of his other buildings farther in the back prevent them from being able to get extra points to be able to do their special abilities. And then I used the Build-A-Bot um, buildings to try and lure his, or not his, I'm sorry, um, enemy attackers from trying to attack from the outsides that they will get pulled more to the insides, pull up to those stasis mines, and let his defenses do the work for him. Now his base is a little bit rushed. Not too bad, but he didn't have really much of a choice. He did have to upgrade his headquarters before he should have, um, and that's just due to the fact that his bots needed to be upgraded. Um, I've had to do it not really what I want to do, but uh, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do and uh, just spend some time on the game and upgrade as quickly and as fast as possible. Like I said, I really wished I could have gotten him that bundle. Um, I wanted to be a surprise uh, for him, especially for the fact that he trusts me with his account that uh, I'm not a hacker, I'm not a thief. Um, I'm here to help. And I'm glad I was given that chance uh, while he was at work. Like I said, he has no idea that I did this. 
So eventually he's going to get on the game. He's going to notice that his uh, base is completely different, that all his workers are currently working and upgrading. Also, one of his bots will be upgrading. Um, I did notice he did get a chance. They are currently in a war. He was able to defeat the first two bases. Now, I did scout out the third base, and I'm not sure he's going to be able to beat it. Um, but I'm willing to try and give it a try for him, especially with Megatron. Uh, he might be able to get around him. So let's see. What could we put in for him and give this thing a try? Let's see if we can use Bombshell's ability to try and divert the, one of the defenses so he can use Megatron to skirt all the way around. Let's give it a try. If it doesn't work... I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, hopefully I can do a surprise for him or somebody else that uh, has given me their username and password that uh, I can either help them out or just surprise them with a gift or whatever. Alright, now notice that his, uh, how that guy's base is, his laser turns all the way on the left, he does have the rocket launcher, he's way more advanced than uh, Roz is. But we're still going to drop our bots all the way in the back far corner. Not up front, all the way in the back, which should prevent his um, defensive base from opening up and deploying that bot. Let's see what we can do here. Drop that down there. Oh, just out of reach. Come on. A little closer, a little closer. Okay. Use the inspiring charge to jump all the way around. I already lost one guy. That's not good. Not much I can do about that. Oh, my dog's a barking. I need my dog to shut up. Need my dog to be quiet. Uh oh, he's in trouble here. Not much I can do. Don't have any ability points. Keep fighting, guys. Keep fighting. Okay, back to a Transformers Earth War. Sorry, I had to pause. <laughs> pause for a moment. I had somebody at the door. My dogs were not going to shut up. Well, we tried to squirt, squirt around there, and uh, just his bots just aren't ready yet. But uh, he's got a lot of upgrades going right now. Uh, he's got a lot of his bots that uh, will be strong enough here pretty soon. Uh, but it was a good attempt at uh, beating it, I think, especially the way that base was built. I do hope, again, you guys enjoyed this. Please like this video, and also make sure you subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Uh, we do do giveaways from time to time. Um, this is our secondary alliance, and the alliance name is Predacon Pit. If you guys are just casual players, uh, they require at least a headquarter seven to join this. Uh, this alliance over here, the main main alliance, is required at least uh, headquarters ten. Um, let's go ahead and take a look in here at the leaderboard. It's a good group of guys. Uh, they got a good uh, commander in here, and they do have good officers. Uh, they'll work with you. They'll help you. Uh, Roz is a fellow uh, YouTuber. Um, so we're here to help. If you're new to the game, you need a little bit of help, um, even if you don't join the Alliance, why don't you check us out? Uh, give us some messages. Um, my line ID is sick and twisted. Uh, be happy to help out, give some information, do whatever I can to help out. It's something I do enjoy to do. I do enjoy this game and uh, would like to hear from you. Comments, suggestions, please put them in, in down below. Contact me online chat. Um, 
for any crystal openings or anything you would like help with if your base is a little struggling you'd like me to check out your base uh, just let me know and i hope that you guys have a wonderful day once again like and subscribe comments below and have a good night